Have you ever wondered why time moves differently on other planets, like in interstellar? It's because time isn't the same everywhere. <laughs> Einstein showed us that space and time are woven together, one giant cosmic fabric, and gravity can bend it. That's right. When you get close to something massive, a giant planet, a star, or worse, a black hole, time itself starts to curve. To you, everything feels normal. You look at your watch, and it's ticking perfectly fine, one second per second. But for someone watching you from far away, they'd see your time slowing down. It's like you're stuck in a river of gravity, and the closer you get to the center, the slower time flows. <laughs> That's why, on planets with extreme gravity, a few hours could equal years on Earth. It's not movie magic, it's real physics. It's Einstein's general relativity, alive and bending the very flow of time. And here's the craziest part. The now you're living isn't the same now somewhere else. Every point in the universe is living its own version of the present. <laughs> it's wild, right? The universe doesn't keep time with a single clock. It's more like an ocean, and every planet, every star, every black hole creates ripples in it. Time isn't fixed. It flows. It stretches. It bends. So next time you look at your watch, just remember, it's only ticking like that because you're not standing next to a black hole.